Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play System Shock. Cam Jack Visco. Okay, that's we you know, you know, heading to that room for, you know, crap hit fan, but I realized I forgot something that was over here. On reviewing my playthrough, I realized I missed the detox patch, and those things are kind of important, so we're gonna take a quick detour, go back and grab it. Glad I screened my video before I left the level, because that would have sucked. There it is. Right where I saw it on the playthrough. Man, it really shows what you can miss on the screen if you're not looking at the right portion of it. It's weird. I didn't realize how much stuff I walked past and didn't do until I started doing Let's Plays. It's like, well, I missed quite a bit when you're just focused on one part of the screen. Eh, oh well. Teague levels high. <laughs> well, he is a hacker. I mean, he's probably, you know, some scrawny little nerd that sits on his butt hacking all day, so yeah, I'm not surprised he has no energy. Probably not the most athletic character. Ooh. Lots of baddies down there. Ow! <coughs> Excuse me. One shot. Crap. Of course, we don't have a healing chamber because those bastards blew it up. I'm not happy about that. They stole our healing chamber. I am very unhappy about that. Okay, he's down. Now we just gotta get the freaks that are in the distance. Can we not shoot the doorway, please? That would be advisable. Just saying. Okay. How many rounds do we have for this frickin'? Man, we've got a ridiculous amount of slug rounds. We really need to start using that gun instead. Okay, so, save. What do we got? Oh, hey, Lucky Sevens, right off the bat. Can we get all... And I suddenly can't remember any other gambling terminology from slots. I don't remember the terms of what's like the... Ooh, that's a good roll. Slugs and penetrator rounds. That's what I'm talking about. Right up your butt. Blow your brains out. Top to bottom. Well, that actually would be bottom to top, but still. Yeah, I can live with that. Okay, so... Anybody's over there? Nope, we're clear. Whoa, no, big guy. Get just the right angle so we can scavenge this weasel. Okay, let's hope that's it. Oh, perfect roll right off the bat. All right, who's emailing me? What do they want? God damn it! I thought we had Shonen's jamming signal beep. Morris is working on it. We've got some information. You'll have to cut through the security level to get to the bridge. We're guessing Shonen has disabled most of the repulsive lifts that spread energy drain lines around the central column. Do you really think your little friend Rebecca can help you? As a matter of fact, I do. Bitch, what you gonna do about it? Okay, we're probably gonna have to use a first aid kit. Security level. It's gonna be a while before we uh, get access to a healing chamber. That's gonna be all kinds of ugly. Okay. What well, do we got ammo wise for the full shed? Oh, we've got tons of the higher level ammo. Um, we're gonna use that for a bit. Yeah. Okay, so we've got the four logic probes, we've got two more down here. We've got the rail gun and the pistol. Which, I don't think we're ever actually gonna be going back to. I honestly think I'm just dragging around because I don't want to leave it behind. Because <laughs> part of me thinks that maybe someday, somehow, some way, we'll need it again. But not likely. So, yeah. Save the game and here we go. Door is locked. What? Why is the door locked? Okay, we got all those. We got all the audio logs. We got the one log from me we haven't heard yet. I've made it. I'm on the security level, but it's a fortress. Elevator's gone. 
have to go up the central shaft of the bridge. There's a control here somewhere that activates the force bridge across the shaft. Energy drain mines prevent me from using the jump jets to get there. It'll be up there somewhere, guarded by filthy cyborgs. He ain't wrong. I know I keep quick saving. Sorry about that. It's for that. Thank you! Apparently you just have to walk up to the door. Once it's plot important, Warning. the door will... Bridge separation process initiated. All unnecessary personnel clear the level. I see you up there, dude. What, is he like out of range or something? No, because I can hit him. What's the deal? Why can't I hit the other dude? Freaky, it's acting like that camera where I couldn't shoot the one guy. Hmm, okay. What the whoa! Hi! Wasn't expecting him to be right there. I should have, but I wasn't. For some reason, I back in my mind, I thought he hadn't spawned yet. I don't know why. There's another one right there. There's one on every one of the four. Oh, whoops. We forgot to flip the audio. Right. Because it's another playthrough from scratch. Well, not from scratch, but it's the first time I've launched it since the last recording, so I have to flip the audio again. Okay, so he fell out of the sky like a stone. Um. Keep an eye on the eye. On the, uh, gotta keep an eye on the sky and the ground so they can't get up behind you. And basically, we're gonna be going up the repulsor list, working our way around. We wanna go up the shortest one first, and then move, I believe, counterclockwise? I think it's counterclockwise. Whoa, he threw a grenade. He's throwing grenades at us! I did not realize he had a grenade launcher. That was unexpected. All right, so we need to stand up and loot this guy because he's going to have our machine gun ammo. Nope, I said machine gun ammo. No, double machine gun ammo. I got to be real specific. Well, I'll take that. It's penetrator rounds. So I'll, I'll, I'll actually take that. Okay, so far so good. Just got to be all methodical about this and stuff. Slug rounds. Okay, yeah, I need to stop using the hollow points. We got so many slugs. I need to start using them instead. Oh, hi, little cyber assassin ninja bitch. Can I get an angle to shoot you in the face, maybe? Be a lot easier if the level wasn't shaking. Seriously, stop shaking, please. Thank you. Just wanted to shoot him in the face, that's all. I don't think that's too much to ask. Stand up, get the angle right on this guy, and loot him. Nope. Double machine gun clips, please. Ho ho ho! Double penetrator rounds. I'll, I'll take that. I will take that. We got so many rounds for the assault rifle, I really need to start using it. Okay, screw all the point, we're going to this. Flechette is the same condition. I've got so many. Do Whoops, he's already dead. Burr. Pay attention. I gotta start using the splinter clips because there's so much ammo for it. So I need to start relying on the heavy duty guns because we're on the final few levels. Hi! Blew you out of the sky. Take your little cyber assassin friend with you. And what do you have? Got two magnesium rounds in it, so go ahead and use it up real quick. Ow! An assassin. Okay, ditch that gun. I need to go pick up my lightsaber. Stop shaking! I need to grab my lightsaber, man. Okay. Oh, the force bridge. Right, I can't. There we go. Got the angle. <laughs> okay. So yeah, he's up there, so we gotta search him. And ooh, nice. We had quite a bit of rounds for the machine gun. I'm surprised. 
Almost. Must start relying on it. Almost. We'll definitely throw it into the mix of the guns we use without a doubt. Come on. Thank you. Okay, he didn't have squat. He had less than squat. He had bupkis. I can't shoot because of the mines. So I'm probably going to have to go around. Sadly, I don't know if we can get him to flop out, so even if we kill him, we can't loot him, which sucks. Hi! Totally forgot you were right there, bro. Let me get right with you. Sheesh. Still can't get the angle on that. Annoying. Can I shoot the assassin, please? Come on. Give me the angle. Come on. Really? Fussy with me, huh? How about this? Really? Can't even hit him with that thing? There, I was gonna say. Come on now, that's what that gun was designed for. This is nonsense. Wait, did you have a hoe? Wait, where? Get in an angle where I can shoot you, punk. Jerk. Plop. And down he goes like a wounded bird. Give me the good stuff. I say the good stuff. Come on. <coughs> my sincerest apologies. Yeah, my throat's a little trash from doing so many uh, Let's Plays of System Shock back to back. Still recovering, so I'm going to be talking as emphatically as I was in previous episodes. But I will try to make up for it in Vicar. I think we got them all. That's the front door. Which means... That's the one that goes back, right? Yeah, it is. Okay. So we gotta come over here, make sure we map all that out, and go up there. Which means we gotta be cute and go jump, 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 jets! Minimal energy used. <laughs> okay, I need to set something down, so I'm going to drop the... Uh, one of the logic probes out here. I'm sure you drop two of them. Oh shoot! I'm gonna drop two of them out here, so they're grouped together, and I'll go get back the one that's at the entrance. Okay, that's all mapped out. Where's the entrance? Like right here, isn't it? Okay. Give me the logic probe. Actually, I'll pull the railgun out because that might get used. That's the one that's way up there. I'm trying to remember which one has the cyborg conversion chamber, because we kind of want to do that first. I don't know if we will, but we want to. So, yeah. Oh, great. We got the big guy right there. That shredded him pretty effectively. Kind of surprised. Okay. Excuse me, I couldn't catch it in time. My sincerest apologies. Definitely gonna follow up with that whole can I record an audio stream from my microphone separately from the audio stream that the game does. If I can, I can edit out the coughing. That'll be a little more professional. So I may have to cough, but at least you won't have to hear it. Till then, I do sincerely apologize. Oh, right, that's the best I'm gonna get from him. What am I thinking? Hello? He's spinning, but the hamster is dead. He's out. Stop. Stop. Give me the lantern. Grab the battery. Throw the battery out. Okay, so we gotta kind of move this crap back out where we put the other stuff. So we do, it was over here? No. It's around the next corner. 
Okay, so we got that there. There were two med kits and another battery, so. Take another logic probe and drop it there. So that's where all the extra stuff is. Move the railgun over to the pile, so it's all in the same area. No. No. You go over there. Play nice. I'm trying to do something civil here. And you gotta go ruin it. I'm on to you, you evil railgun. Conspiring against me and such. Okay, so we got a spare battery, so we can actually use the shields if we need to. But you stop going to that mode. It really does irk me. Well, that's the other door. There's the button. So we should just be able to go. Aha! Mow you down quickly. Switch back to the main screen so I can see what the heck I'm doing. And if we get lucky, within a couple of rolls, we'll have the ammo types we want. There we go. Okay, what? Apparently I didn't glance right, so I didn't map it out. That's kind of annoying. Yay! More EMPs! Always a good thing. You can spam them on the robots, and they can't really do anything back to you. Okay, so I should be able to stash this with the other junk. So that's all together. Um, I gotta find that other door. Is this it? Yeah, this was it. I just keep getting all this crap. I gotta move. To pain. Pain, I tells you. To pain. Wait, no. Where's the? Yeah, okay. It's on the other side. So I'm on the far side. That's where the rifle is. So I'm gonna drop it. It was the right, not the left, or left, not the right. It was the other direction. That's what I meant to say. We'll drop you here because we know we're gonna need the space to grab the other battery. We could use the energy, but honestly, there's no point in topping off, because we're better off <coughs> excuse me, saving that for later, in case we really, really need it. So that's the shortest one, but that only goes up to this and then comes back down. We don't have this unlocked yet. We'll at least map it out and then go back down. Okay, so that's the shortest one. So it's this and then clockwise? I guess. Let's find out. Here we go. Vaporize you to get you out of the way. Save the game. Let's see what we can get out of this dude. I'm tired of stamina patches. I do not need them. I never use them. Thank you very much. Okay, we don't have access to that door. Hi. I don't know why. I just wasn't really expecting somebody to be standing there. Which is ridiculous, because I should have known he's there, because I really do know where most of the spawns are, and I don't know why I magically expected him not to be there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. You cannot kill me. That's not allowed. I cannot die. That would be bad. You know what? I'll actually take that. So I kind of need the med patch. Is this... Okay, it doesn't even have any ammo on it, so we don't need it. Okay, so... Another medical thingy. Um, I have to throw it off the balcony, because we can't take it with us. Um, stuff's over there, so... Yeah! Okay, close enough. Search the dead dude. Shield 3. Oh, right, we need to upgrade the lantern 3, so it's even better. Back to the weapon. Map that out. Come back around. Hi. There's the group access we needed. Come on, give me the good stuff. The good stuff. Uh, I don't have room for a med kit. I need 
better ammo than that, please. There we go. Thank you. Now I can go with... Okay, so... Now we can open this door. Grab some landmines. No. And take the battery, throw it with the others. Yeah! And there we go. So, I said that's all mapped out. Okay. You know what, I think I'm actually going to switch here. Keep getting so many med kits. Take the battery pack that we're not really using, throw that with the others, and carry the three med kits. Ah, the body. Grab the med kit. Med kit! Thank you! Here we go. So good. Anybody home? Can we actually reach that guy? Because that would be like awesome. What if we... Oh, well, that was unproductive. I'm not going to bother to waste the energy because that used up like three pips. Okay. And just clip and reload. Before I go through on that switch, uh, I want to finish mapping out this little area here. Med, no, no, grab that med kit, thank you. Toss it over there. Is there anything in here? Or are these just camera views? Okay, they're all just camera views. There's no buttons or anything to flip. Although I do need to remember to do this. Critters, please. I want to be able to see the baddies on the map. So I think this is the floor we get navigation and mapping. It kind of has to be. There's only two floors left. So, duh, hi! How you doing? You know, we discussed this whole personal space issue. You, I don't think you were listening. Ah! Wrong save game. I'll take it. I'll take it, I'll take it, I'll take it. Okay, once we get all the security, we actually unlock... That, which is the uh, plasma view. There's the third suit. Okay. We're going to only have three clips, so we're not going to switch to it yet. Once we do, we will be getting rid of the flechette. And at that point, the Magnum will be the lowest end gun. That would be the one that's most cost effective to take the cameras out. That's what I was talking about, you know, sign of decadence and system shock. It's when the Magnum is the least powerful gun you have, but you have to use it to break things. Blocked by shortened secure. Really? Not just cuz here. Let's top off because I don't know what's up ahead. I'd rather be prepared. So this goes that way. So far, so good, but I don't trust it. Machine gun ammo. Wow, spark beam. Yeah, like we're going to be using... Ah, hi! I forgot about you. It should be the last surprise. We sniped everybody else up. That was the only one where we couldn't actually see anybody. Um... else in the neighborhood? I think we're clear. I think. I hope. Just guessing here. 
Okay, here we go. Keycard, command access. Ammo, ammo. Nothing here, nothing over there. What we got here? Ah! Wrong save game again. Dang it! Curse you! You were trying to foil me! I'm on to you! I'm on to you! Remember correctly, this has penetrator rounds in it. Yeah, so we actually want to hold on to that particular rifle. Use up this one until it's empty and then flip over to the other rifle. You know what, screw it. With four rounds. Flip! And get rid of that, and we'll just use the magnum and the flechette for now until we need something really, really heavy duty. In which case, we'll use the other one. This flips this. Nope. Blocked by showdown security. Can't do it yet. so bad, considering. I was expecting him to shred us, so that's how he missed quite a bit of times. Huh. Okay. Good time. Nopes. 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 Nope. Come on, give me the good stuff. Give me the good stuff. Give me the good stuff. Come on, you know you wanna... I'm your friend. You wanna give me the good stuff, you know you do. Come on. Show me the monkey! Screw it, we'll take this. So, machine gun. There's a possibility it actually has ammo in it, so we're gonna unload ours. Take this one. And. Nope! They're both empty. Never mind! Go ahead and reload that puppy. We're actually going to stick with the ion bolt. Even though the plasma gun's really, really good, there is a downside to the plasma gun. It fires a circular ball, kind of like the Invisimides, and it bounces around. It's not accurate. It's not fast. It's While it's insanely powerful and pretty much vaporizes anything it touches, it can bounce off the wall and hit you, too. So it's kind of a double-edged sword. It's not really that good of a... Because it can do so much damage against you, it's not that good of a weapon, because it's so dangerous. All it takes is one screwed up shot, and you're a post toasty, so yeah. Okay, we got a hack at the cyberspace, but first I want to check out this other room. Oh, hello! Goodbye, computer nodes! 9%. Sweet. Okay. So the security is officially torched as far as the nodes go. So she's lost major control on this level. Okay, we need to save and hack into cyberspace, but that's going to have to wait for the next episode because we're at the time limit. Thank you everybody for joining me. You guys are awesome fans. I appreciate you watching my videos. It means a lot to me. I hope you're enjoying them. And I will see you guys later. So you take care of yourselves. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.